yes i am focused hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if this is your first time seeing me in today's video i'm gonna be doing all the plex treatment in my hair i need to stop looking at the viewfinder right <laughs> Sorry, getting used to this. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing all the plex treatment today. Um, that's really it. Um, this is the day after, so I styled my hair. You know, these cute little buns. And my hair is actually it didn't come out pink. It looks more red, but it's whatever. Overall, I rated the product like a 10 out of 10 because. I can feel the health of my hair change and all of that so yeah overall the product was great I totally recommend it but um if you don't need it don't go out and get it for the hype because I feel like I probably didn't need it that bad but I still spent like a hundred dollars on these products just because I heard it was so good and I don't regret it at all because my hair is healthier I just feel like Keep in mind, if your hair is already healthy and you want to use these products, you're not going to notice an immediate difference, but it's still working. So that's all that matters. So yeah, I'm going to stop rambling, get right into the video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Y'all know the drill, but no pressure. If you don't want to subscribe, you don't got to subscribe because you're going to see me again and you're going to want to subscribe. So yeah. So, today I'm going to be doing Olaplex treatment. I have number three. Fuck. How do I do? Oh, number three. Right? This is, it says repairs and strengthens all hair type. The original Olaplex hair perfecter. Um, I heard really good things about this. So, yeah. And I also have number eight which is a Bond Intense Moisture Mask. I already used this on my hair. I really didn't notice a difference, but I guess. <laughs> um, so what I'm doing with my hair today, I'm doing the Olaplex treatments, but I'm also bleaching and dyeing my hair. I'm doing a skunk stripe, which I parted out, and it's gonna be hot pink per. And right now, I have, oh crap, I'm sorry, I have black hair dye in my hair. I'm trying to not get it on my nails. I decided to dye my hair black because, um, let me just see if I can show y'all. This is how it's looking. So yeah. Um, I decided to dye my hair black because before this, I tried- Oh, f Oh my god, that shit hurt. Um, like I was saying, before this, I tried to dye my hair like auburn, orangey, brunette. So, that's the color it was. It was more like this color, if you can see it, yeah. So, as you can see the difference, it's very clear. So, I just wanted- I really don't know why I dyed my hair black. I'm really trying to wear my natural hair more, so I'm gonna be wearing like clip-ins and stuff, and it's easier to match like weaves and extensions if your hair is just jet black, so I thought I would do that. Okay, so I feel like I should've I never did this before, so I don't know what this Alright, so the products I'm be using, I'm going to just show y'all now, and I'm probably going to show you again. I'm just really anxious, so I'm going to be using this. Oh, so I went to Ulta today, and I bought this. Yes, this is like a blow drying brush, so it would be way more easier for me to blow dry my hair which is why I bought this it's um it's a 10 miracle leave-in product right excited to test that out and then I got this in mint I wonder how it smells wow. 
It kind of smells like um gum. It's not cute, but whatever. I also got this because I needed a little oil to put on my hair and some of these oils be stinking and I don't like that. So let me see how this smells. Oh my gosh. Wow, this smells like not blueberries, but it smells fruity and like I'm using this because as you know I wear wigs a lot and you can't really tell right now but like my edges is going like they going <laughs> so I've been using this to try to grow them back but this stinks bro it stinks it smells like like what's that called fertilizer like on a farm it stinks so yeah I'm gonna be using those products but right now I'm gonna get into bleaching also by now you guys probably noticed that my audio quality and my video quality is up to par well that's cuz for my birthday I bought myself a camera I got the Sony ZV-1 um, you know, I was gonna be basic and get the Canon G7X like every other YouTuber, but I, I watched a lot of reviews and one of my favorite YouTubers, Kyra. If you know Kyra, then gang gang. But um, yeah, Kyra, she uses this and her quality is spot on. Like, I'm hype. Like, y'all don't know. Like, y'all see the background? Blurred, baby. Focused on me. What's it called? Audio A1, up to par, all of that. So yeah, I bought myself a camera for my birthday and then my boyfriend bought me a MacBook. So I feel official now. I feel like there's nothing stopping me but myself from um, taking YouTube seriously. So yeah, I'm really happy about my gifts. I really appreciate it. Like, Gifts is fun and all, but like when somebody takes time out to invest in your future, it's like really sentimental. And y'all know MacBooks is not cheap. So shout out to you, babe, for buying me that for my birthday. I love it. Oh, I can show y'all right now, actually. So here it is. I already bought a case because I'm not playing. This computer and this camera better last me for like 10 years. This is the case that I got, and I also got a little thingy and a screen protector. What is this? Um, this is the MacBook Pro 2020. Yeah, I got it in gray too, so yeah. Thanks, babe. All right, so whilst I was just talking, I took like half a scoop of my BW bleach. And I'm gonna use 20 volume developer. I really have no idea how this is gonna go. Cause the instruction said leave this on for 15 minutes and it's been like 15 minutes. And I know it's gonna take, wow, my curls is popping, yo. Popping like, I just love how when I dye my hair, my curls pop. But when I use all these expensive products, all these conditioners and oils, it doesn't give like, before this, my hair was straight. And this is just dye. Look at my clothes. Okay. All right. So I'm going in with my 20 volume developer. I'm just gonna eyeball this because I don't know shit about shit. It's out. So I'm gonna just go in and be really careful. So yeah. Wish me luck, y'all.
Okay, so quick intermission. I washed my hair like four times. My nail is a completely different color. Wow, one of my eyes is really smaller than the other. Hmm. Anyway, so yeah, I washed my hair like three times. I dyed the half black that I showed you, rinsed that out. Then I had to bleach twice because um, honestly, the bottoms was darker, but it actually came out way better than I thought. Oh my God. Okay, my hair feels kind of like right here feels dry and stringy. Like everywhere else seems good. It's like since I dyed my hair black, my curls are way more like visible like you could see the pattern do a 360 I don't know what back hair looks like but yeah so I've been doing this for like it's nine o'clock we started this at like four so I'm really over it my hair is damp so I'm about to go in with number three and apply a generous amount from scalp to ends up here until it's thoroughly saturated so I'm just gonna go in sections because honestly my hair is kind of thick and y'all yeah, know Olaplex with these little bottles they claim it's like three to four treatments and it never really gives I used number eight one time and it's like a little bit left in there so if you are thick hair girl just be aware of that all right so I don't have no edges y'all mind me <laughs> so I'm gonna just I'm gonna do four sections Hey, future me checking in. I forgot to tell you guys that this is how the product looked in my hair after letting it sit for maybe like 15 minutes. And I could already tell that my hair felt different. It felt healthy and it was shiny and my curls was popping. So yeah. Okay, so I'm back, fresh out the shower. Um, it's probably been like 10, 20 minutes. So I'm gonna take this out. How do I do this? And see how it looks. Ugh. Um, honestly, I don't notice a difference in my curl pattern because my hair is not really that damaged honestly like I barely do anything to my hair I usually wear wigs most of the time but um I mean I know for a fact that this works because the science behind it I just don't see a huge difference right now but um the difference I do feel is that this part when I first washed it was like hard and crispy and dry like it felt like if I was to comb it it would break off and it feels like more hydrated now my curls are still there which is shocking 
So, I'm just gonna, honestly, I don't know. I thought I was like, I was expecting like phenomenal life changing results. It's like, most of the people I watched, they had a lot of heat damage and their curls came back. I didn't really have that issue. I'm just glad to know that my hair is healthy. I'm going to blow dry my hair like I showed you guys, like I showed you guys earlier with the thingy I bought. So you're supposed to put this in right now, like after you shampoo and everything, but I kind of mixed them together whilst this was in my hair because on the bottle it says that you can. So I did that because I was honestly tired of washing my hair. Like I washed my hair like four times already. I'm just really concerned because this does not look pink at all. Like this looks pink but like it's giving red hawaiian punch and i don't want that all right like i was saying i'm going to put this in my hair because i'm blow drying it i'm gonna put some leave-in conditioner and some oil and that's it like it's really it so yeah i'm about to do it and i'm not gonna talk so. Okay, so overall, I would give this a 10 out of 10. Even though I didn't visibly see a difference, I definitely can tell the difference by the texture, how my hair is reacting. Usually, when I comb out my hair and add products, my hair is not curly. Like, it's just, it's like this. It's just like straight. But if you could see on this side, it's like, way more defined this side obviously is not giving because i did just bleach it and do that shit to it but yeah i give this a 10 out of 10 i feel like if you hear like mine you should use this to just maintain healthy hair if you're gonna color and bleach and flat iron especially if you flat iron your edges because i know that's a trend right now get this because I feel like it reverts heat damage. I don't know. I usually have most of my heat damage in the front of my hair and it's like super curly. Like, <laughs> So yeah, I know for a fact that this product did work. I just thought that, I don't know, I thought my hair would feel like silky and luxurious, but I'm not white, so <laughs> I don't know why I thought that. But yeah, I'm overall happy with the results. I mean, I guess if you enjoyed my video, leave a comment telling me what I should do with my natural hair because that's really all I plan to be focusing on from now on. So yeah, thanks for watching.